It's the NBA on 2K Sports. Along with Greg Anthony and Clark Kellogg, this is... We've got a chance now for our starting lineup from point guard to center. This game should be a good one. First for the Cavaliers. Kevin Love out there with Tristan Thompson. We've got Channing Fry, a very solid big man who will be making every effort to control the glass and make some big plays under the rim. Then there's Amon Shumpert. And it's Love in at the fourth. And for the Warriors, Curry and Thompson, the splash He's in the back. You got Ian Clark. He'll be battling over the boards to get the job done, both on offense and defense. And it's West, and it's Green in at the power forwards position. James, the pass to Irving. No good on the three. On defense, Cleveland. It's a three-point game. Let's it go from 11. That one a tad offline to the right, but drops in for him. And I don't think we can talk about him without also mentioning his tendency to just erupt and string together a bunch of baskets in a row in a real short period of time. Here's Thompson. Can't get it to go. And Golden State will go the other way with it. Durant dishes to Green. Some nice passing by Golden State. Pass to Durant. Fires from deep. Another three for Golden State. Just reliable, guys. He's just always trying to make the right play. They need a good offensive possession. Yeah, they've had a number of empty ones. A long time without a basket. They gotta find something you're right. Irving kicks to Love. Feeds it to James to end the run. He clangs that one off the back iron and down it falls. Boy, he made a nice little bounce pass there. We call that the pocket pass, and he did it well. Now it's ended down to Doris Burke, who was able to talk with head coach Teron Lee. We talked about David West and what makes him such a tough player to defend. Coach said West is special because he's so skilled for a player of his size and strength. He can score inside and also spread the floor with his shooting. He can have a quiet night and still drop 20 and 10. So we've got to stay conscious of him at all times. Guys, we'll see how they do against him. And thank you for that, Doris. Curl, covered by Irving. Durant, the pass to Green. That's good. A nice assist from Durant. Green's got himself going there. His first points of the game on the deep ball. For Cleveland, they've gone just one of four to get this game started. Outside Irving. Back to James. Dishes to Smith. And it's out of bounds. The Cavalier is able to retain possession here. And they're really no choice but to lunge for that pass to make sure it didn't get through. Yeah, and that was important. Probably would have been a quick two points if he doesn't get a hand on it and knock it out of bounds. And it's a completely new group on the floor for the Cavaliers. First quarter of ball, almost two and a half minutes in. Rose goes in. And two free throws coming up as he misses that one. Drawing the whistle and a lot of contact there. You know, one of his other qualities, Steve, is how quickly he starts to break. I mean, he doesn't need numbers either. He can be a coast-to-coast, rack-to-rack guy all by himself. And that one falls for Jamal Crawford. And so Jamal Crawford nails both of them. He has such terrific form and consistency on his free throw. Beautiful to watch. Livingston kicks to Iguodala. Young, right side. A three. And another three for Golden State. This looks like a pregame shoot-around with all the threes they're allowing. I don't know. There might be more defense in the warm-ups. Right now, these are just shooting game shots. Corver dishes to Green. Back to Corver. Lock at six. Cleveland needs to get a shot off here. They get a hand on it. And an overpowering first quarter effort. Already a double digit advantage. Well, not exactly a close game so far, but as the second quarter starts here, plenty of time for a comeback. And what do you guys think so far about the offensive approach for the Warriors? 
They've definitely had a hot hand from three-point range. Always nice to get off to a good start. They've been distributing the ball really well tonight, too. I mean, a decent number of assists so far for them. As forceful a finish as you're ever going to see out of this guy. Well, gee, it adds now to their lead in spectacular fashion. And, you know, that lead's only going to grow if they're not prepared to defend a little more staunchly than that. Outside Rose. Back to Jefferson. Foul call that time on the way up. That'll give him two chances at the free throw line here. The Cavaliers have had two chances at the line already, making them both. And Cleveland making a change here. And both free throws good for Williams. Warriors leading by 13. Durant kicks it to West. From beyond the arc. That's good. And a nice assist from Durant. Durant's got four assists now tonight. These defenders are putting up very little resistance to the three-point shot. And it's killing four of the last five makes coming from long range. And they double up James. Shumpert passes to James. The 11-footer uses the glass to drop it in. James has got his second bucket. Golden State's gotten on a roll from three-point land. They've been flawless. Six for six tonight. Got that bucket in in no time at all. So, timeout called here. The first for Cleveland. Yeah, it's got to be concerned with all the missed shots here. And every team goes through cold streaks. You just got to figure out a way to stay productive. And the best way to do that when you're missing shots is to get to the foul line. Be aggressive, get to the foul line, and knock down some of those freebies, and the tide can turn for you. Catching up on the changes for Cleveland. Fry comes in for Darren Williams. And it's Kevin Love in for Jamal Crawford. Thompson sets the pick for Shumper. The pass to Irving. He dishes it to Thompson. Six to shoot. Good work on the boards. They pick up the second chance points. Thompson's got his first points in this one. And I also can't get over how much energy he expends rebounding the basketball. He goes all out on the boards every single night. Back to Thompson. Let's it go with a three. That one fall. Coming off Iguodala's feed. Iguodala's got three assists now in this one. The Cavaliers trail by 17. Irving dishes to Shumper. And Durant with the block. Out of bounds, Golden State takes possession. And the Cavaliers making a change here. Smith has checked in. Warriors leading by 17. There's the dish to Pachulia. Drops it in from 11 feet. Boy, can he finish in the paint. That's one thing we know he's good at. Cavaliers have gone 2 of 5 in the field here in the second quarter, shooting 40%. Irving against Curry. Irving drives in. There's the block. They get it back. Warriors have gone a sensational 5 of 5 from the field since the start of the second quarter. And he gets the bucket. Durant's got his second bucket of the night. You know, there's no better sign of how efficiently a team is operating than their assist number. And theirs are fantastic. Just beautiful when they play the game like this. James, no good. And, and, and typically he has the touch to finish when he's in tight, but not sure on that position. And, and as they continue to just dominate this game, you have to wonder how much can they win by. Well, it's on the verge of getting out of hand, Greg. You can feel it, you can see it, in part because the defense has been about as good as the offense, and both have been really good. So as we conclude the first half, so far, fairly one-sided. Warriors ahead, running away with this one.
And as we welcome you back, we begin our second half. So far, not a tightly contested game, guys, but you know, anything can happen. Here's Smith. He's been patient so far. Nothing yet on the scoreboard. Love kicks to Smith. Back to Love. Passes it to Smith. Shot clock at six. Pulls up. High post. And it's wide right. It's off the rim. He's the one guy that I think the defense is going to live with being open. Green, the pass to Kirk. And another three for Golden State. He's also a guy, Steve, whose confidence is not very easy to shake. And that's an important quality to have. He'll miss a few shots in a row, but they're not going to cause him to doubt himself. Not in the least. Irving with the ball. James kicks to Love. And a foul called on the shot. Got him on the way up that time, so he'll shoot two right here. He's getting his first free throw attempt of the night right now. John Walls checked in for Golden State. Caspi comes in for Sean Livingston. Both free throws, good from Love. And a minute played as the second half gets going. Outside, Green. Back to Curry. Golden State moving the ball around. And Green with the basket on the assist by Curry. Green's got six. How many times have we seen a possession to take that from them today? Ending with a basket coming off a pretty pass. Well, when you look at the assist total, heck, they've been clearly the better team. Irving gets to Smith. That's the Thompson. Six on the shot clock. Now Young inside. It's stolen by Amon Shumpert. Curry against Smith. Kicks it to Thompson. Second shot opportunity. And it's good on the way in. And the defense just gets caught standing around that time and giving up the second chance opportunity. You know, that just can't happen. They need much more effort than that on the glass. Holding their first turnover of the game, taking terrific care of the basketball. And that's one more key to their lead, guys. I mean, they're creating opportunities for each other and not the other team. Two minutes into the second half of play now. Now, here is Irving. Looking for his first basket still in this one. It's rebounded by Livingston. Golden State's gone two of two from long range in the third quarter so far. Shots good from Young. Clearly, they've been the hotter team here in the first half. Well, they've been grit and grind, working for those high percentage shots. And quite honestly, it's paid off for them. Love kicks to Green. Love with the screen on Durant. The drive by Green. And that basket is going to count. Goaltending the official call. He didn't get to that one quite in time, Kevin. Those can be tough to gauge sometimes. And an instant reaction to that call from the fans. Well, you know, they can be very vociferous when they disagree. And that whistle did not go over well with the crowd. Catching up on the changes for Cleveland. Channing Fries checked in for Derek Williams. Mon Shumpert has come in for Tristan Thompson. And it's Crawford in for Kevin Love. Outside Rose. 17 seconds left to play in the third. James dishes to Rose. Down to five on the shot clock. Shot no good. Boy, blew the easy two by profile. Trying to look good. That's a bad decision and poor execution. The three quarters of play all in the books. And this one. And we're rolling here again with the fourth quarter. Might not come down to the wire, but you never know. Hey, guys, what do you think about the offensive approach we've seen so far for the Warriors? So far, they've turned in a fantastic performance from the three-point line. It's been a weapon all game. And I also love the way they move the basketball. Their passing has been outstanding here in the second half. Pass to McCaw. Shoots the three. 
and he gets it to go. They just continue to splash home those threes. Eliminating the deep shot has to become priority number one for this defense. Absolutely. You cannot allow a team to have that kind of a rhythm from beyond. Rose goes in. He kicks to front. Back to Rose. Played in with a nice touch off the glass. They are just killing them on the interior. Yeah, you can't say that with enough emphasis. I mean, the defenders are just not being aggressive enough down low. You got to play with some physicality in the paint. Defensively, they just look out of sync, not closing out on the threes in time. Well, I think they're getting caught in that in-between zone, no man's land, giving up three straight from beyond the arc right now. And he was fouled on the way up. Two free throws now for him. No, I tell you what, he earned his money on that foul. Yeah, if you're going to foul, then make sure that you don't give a chance for the and one. And the Warriors making a change here. Young's checked in. And so Jamal Crawford nails both of them. This is as good as it gets from the charity strike here in the second. Yeah, you know what? And I think they've just got to keep on keeping on. Keep drawing contact, attacking, getting to the line. That will certainly give them a chance to get back into the game. Caspi's gone 2-2 two two from three-point land tonight. Outside Rose. The feed to Jefferson. Cannot hit. And you can see why the defense is willing to roam and take their chances with this jump. That's good. And that's the dagger right there. Really the nail in the car. I'd agree. I mean, they've done a great job of sealing this and closing it out. And they never backed off, even with the big lead. I love to see teams do that. Terrific job that time defending at the rim. I mean, it's not an easy task stopping that fella when he's headed to the bucket like that. Good job. And from an offensive standpoint, they have just been stellar. Yeah, really good. I mean, extremely well-coached, fluid, efficient. Man, it's been a lot of fun to watch. The points just keep piling up because they've been uh, such a well-oiled machine. And Fry kicks to Jefferson. He feeds it to Fry. They need this. The shot is off. The Warriors go the other way. Now the pass to McCaw from deep. Another three for Golden State. Well, if it wasn't out of reach, it is now thanks to that last little spurt. And why put the brakes on now? I just say keep on letting it fly. Rose passes to Shumper. Back to Rose. And the defense didn't have position. They whistle a blocking foul, and he'll go to the line. And that one falls for Jamal Crawford. And the Cavaliers making a change here. And so Jamal Crawford nails both of them. Fourth quarter of play, and we're about two and a half minutes through it right now. Here's Livingston. And that comes off the assist by John Wall. And you can sense the fact that they didn't want to let the fans down here. It's been a fun night to be in the building. Greg, it really has been. I mean, such a lively vibrant atmosphere and no doubt that played a part in the big win you know he's not your typical NBA center in terms of height guys but he plays as big as any of them thanks to his incredible bounce ability West and the bucket counts and he's on his way to the free throw line try to make it a three point play excellent execution of the plan there that free throw good from West Now Rose, outside Corver, three-pointer. It's rebounded by West. Shoots again, Golden State. This is what happens when he gets on a roll. I mean, you're not going to see a better rhythm shooter than this guy. So we see the Warriors taking the game here. They poured it on tonight, Clark. A dominant showing in front of a crowd that loved every minute of it. I don't think they have anything but positives to take away from this win. Offensively, defensively, every aspect of the game, it all went right, Paul. And that'll do it, folks. This is Kevin Harlan saying thank you for watching. As Jordan presents our player of the game, David West.